Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the MCQ of Fluid Mechanics in the topic of properties of fluids. So the first question, the mass per unit volume of liquid at the standard temperature and pressure is called Option A, specific weight, Option B, mass density, Option C, specific gravity, Option D, none of them. So the correct answer is Option B, mass density. So next question, the weight per unit volume of liquid at the standard temperature and pressure is called Option A, specific weight, Option B, mass density, Option C, specific gravity, Option D, none of the above. So the correct answer is Option A, specific weight. So next question, the ratio of specific weight of the liquid to the specific weight of the pure water is the standard temperature is called Option A, density of liquid, Option B, specific gravity of liquid, Option C, compressibility of liquid, Option D, surface tension of liquid. So the correct answer is Option B, specific gravity of liquid. So next question, the specific gravity of water is taken as Option A, 0.001, Option B, 0 0.01, Option C 0 0.1, Option D 1. So the correct answer is Option D 1. So next question, the mass of 2.5 meter cube of certain liquid is 2 tons. Its mass density is Option A 200, Option B 400, Option C 600, Option D 800. So the correct answer is Option D 800 kg per meter cube. So next question, the specific gravity of oil whose specific weight is 7.85 km per meter cube is option A 0 0.8, option B 1, option C 1.2, option D 1.6. So the correct answer is option A 0 0.8. So next question, the property of liquid which offers resistance to the movement of one layer of liquid over another adjacent of the liquid is option A surface tension, option B compressibility, Option C, capillarity. Option D, viscosity. So the correct answer is option D, viscosity. So next question, the force per unit length is the unit of option A, surface tension. Option B, compressibility. Option C, capillarity. Option D, viscosity. So the correct answer is option A, surface tension. So next question, the variation in the volume of liquid with the variation of pressure is called option A, surface tension, option B, compressibility, option C, capillarity, option D, viscosity. So the correct answer is option B, compressibility. So next question, the reciprocal of compressibility is known as option A, Young's modulus, option B, expansion index, option C, bulk modulus, option D, compression index. So the correct answer is option C, bulk modulus. So next question, when the small diameter tube is dipped in the water, the water rises in the tube with the, with an upward dash surface, option A, flat surface, option B, concave surface, option C, parabolic surface, option D, convex surface. So the correct answer is option C, concave surface. So next question, a glass tube of smaller diameter is used while performing an experiment of the capillarity rise of water because option A, it is easier to see through the glass tube, option B, glass tube is cheaper than the metallic tube, option C, it is not possible to conduct the experiment with any other tube, option D, all the above. So the correct answer is option A, it is easier to see through the glass tube. So next question, mercury does not wet the glasses. This is due to the property of liquid known as option A, coercion, option B, attraction, option C, viscosity, option D, test surface tension. So the correct answer is option D, surface tension. So next question, with an increase in the size of tube, the rise of depression of liquid in the tube due to the surface tension will be option A increases, sorry, option A decreases, option B increases, Option C, remain unchanged. Option D, depend upon the characteristics of liquid. So the correct answer is option A, decreases. So next question, the falling drops of water become spherical due to the property of option A, surface tension of water. Option B, compressibility of water. Option C, capillarity of water. Option D, viscosity of water. So the correct answer is option A, surface tension of water. So next question, a vessel of 4 meters cube contains a oil which weights 30 kN. The specific weight of the soil is option A 4.5, option B 6, option C 7.5, option D 10. So the correct answer is option C 7.5 kN per meter cube.